Hey everyone, Josh from the Kenwood Training Department, here to talk to you today about how to connect your smartphone or tablet to one of our DRV-A series dash cameras by using the Kenwood Dash Cam Manager app. Let's dig into it and see how this connection process works. In today's example, I'm going to be using a DRV-A501W. Now I have this camera installed in my truck, but I'm going to be taking it off of the mount by utilizing the quick detach magnetic mounting option so that I can properly display the screen. That way it's easier for you to follow along with me and the steps that I take. First things first, you wanna make sure to download the Kenwood Dash Cam Manager application to your smartphone or your tablet. Now you can do this inside of the Apple Store or the Google Play Store. And once you have this downloaded, then we can begin the connection from your smartphone or tablet to your Kenwood Dash Camera. Before we can start the pairing process, we have to make sure that the camera is not in recording mode. Now we do this by pressing the OK button, which also doubles as the record button. Now once we've pressed this and we verify that the camera is not in recording mode, by there being no recording links in the top corner, we're going to long press the exclamation point, which also doubles as the wireless link connection button. Now after we've long pressed and held this for just a moment, the screen will then change to the wireless link mode, which also will display the password that we're gonna need here in just a second to make this connection. Now once we've downloaded the Kenwood Dash Cam Manager application and our wireless dash camera is in wireless link mode, we'll want to open up the Kenwood Dash Cam Manager app. At that point, we'll press connect in the bottom right corner, and it'll take us to a screen that says Kenwood Dash Cam Manager. We actually want to press this blue arrow in the top left corner, and then go back to the Wi-Fi connections, and we want to search for the dash camera. Here we can see Kenwood DRV A501W, so we'll tap that then we'll be prompted to enter that password that we just spoke about, which in this case is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then we're gonna press join. Now once we've pressed join, the connection has been established, we can exit out of the Wi-Fi pairing, go back to the dash cam manager application, and then press continue. Now I know for this example, we used an iPhone, but I'd like to point out the connection process for an Android device is fairly similar. Now once we've established this connection between our smartphone or tablet and the Kenwood Dash Camera through the Kenwood Dash Cam Manager application, it opens up a wide variety of very valuable and resourceful features that we've jam-packed for you inside of this application. Now in the next videos, I'll be talking to you about how beneficial and how to use some of these many great features. So stay tuned and we'll see you on the next one. Thank you. Kenwood.